Good morning. My name is Eric Thomas, CWIT, 1027-9142. I'm a former cadet major, battalion honor representative, retired, which is good because there's no honor in what's being asked of me today. I'm in two Citadel Fantasy Football Leagues. I'm an expansion member of the Citadel Dogs, and I'm the former commissioner of GFD Fantasy, the latter of which has issued me a directive. Choose one. As any principal leader would know, sometimes you have to make tough decisions. So today, I plan to do just that. So here's the deal. ESPN execs reached out to me and wanted to make a spectacle of this thing. I agreed to it on terms that Jamal Brantley flew down here to host it and all the proceeds went to the Boys and Girls Club, Hoag's Hair Plugs, and the Wounded Warrior Project. No, I don't. I flew in to find out just like the rest of y'all. <laughs> I haven't seen Eric for a while. I think you guys gonna be in for a show. Drew Kings, <laughs> biggest boss. Huh. All right, so now we wait for Eric to get here. Um, as you see, we back home and um, waiting to find out if he's gonna choose between the forty dollar league or the five thousand dollar league. So now we just wait for him to get here, find out the big news. Yeah, yo, in a rent a car. I'm sold out by ten o'clock. Chicken sold the chickens flock. Pimp them like a Mona Scott. Hello, everyone. This is Corinne Rixie reporting from Johnson Hagen Stadium. We have been eagerly awaiting Eric Thomas's announcement about whether he is going to be in the five thousand dollar league or stick with the forty dollar. Lizzie, over to you. It is rowdy out here. The campus is closed to the public, and this is as far as the media can get. And thank God it is. I haven't been able to stay out of the headlines lately. You got to make sure they're prepared for it. The magnification of any mistake they make. But the truth of him is that he has no eye of the tiger, Stephen A. Where would you go? I don't think anybody would be shocked if he does leave. Nobody knows what he's going to do. What would leaving do to his legacy? Are you guys ready up there? All right. All right, on the set. The pundits and panelists can talk as much as they want. But with all the speculation behind us, there's only one thing left to do. Eric, a question everyone wants to know. What's your decision? This fall, man, it's tough. Uh, this fall, I'm taking my talents to Charlotte ah! and joining the Civil Dogs 5,000 dollars. Is that the conclusion you woke up with this morning? That's the conclusion I woke up with this morning. Well, there you have it, folks. A decision that's going to rock the world. Season's going to be one for the books. A little wilder. Okay, we're going to have to shut it down. Send it back to Bristol for more reaction on in the sports world. Hi, Eric. This is Olivia Harlan with ESPN, and your buddies are really excited to have you. The Citadel Dogs, I hope you guys have a great season, and it sounds like you already have a lot of fun together. So good luck, E. Philly. James Reeves here, 2015 Delta grad. Big money, E is going to the big money league. Never a doubt, GFD. Little E, make sure you bring that trophy home this year. You know I'm number 54 on that Viking defense. And make sure you get that Viking defense. Go Nose, Skull Viking. Little E, bring it home. We are counting on you. Eric, great decision. Good choices, man. You're going to kill it this season. I know you will. Shout out to Delta Frat Boys. We're going to get it. Good afternoon, Little E. This is your favorite Hall of Famer, Derek Brooks, and I want to wish you luck on your upcoming Fantasy Football League this year. Good luck this season, Little E, and go Knowles. Hey, Eric, it's Austin from Last Chance U Season 3. Good luck to you and the dogs this season, man. You go get that money. Yo, E.T., what's up, man? It's that time of year, Fantasy Football, brother. I hear you a bad man. <laughs> I wanted to wish you well. I think you'll be okay, because you're an Ohio boy. Listen, I'm not going to hold a press conference, but I do want to express my appreciation to all the obvious, close, and personal friends of mine. It means more than you know. To be honest, this decision came down to one thing, so I'll leave you with this. When people show you who they are, believe them. What a time to be alive. You and yours versus me and mine. Are we talking teams? Are we talking teams? Are you switching sides? Want to come with me? Cause I got a really big team, and they need some really big rings They need some really nice things, better be coming with no strings